Today, we are going to install the new VRT Motorsports CAX3 RP1 Dual Shear Radius Rod Plate. This plate fits the 2017 Plus Can MX3 2 and 4 door models. Install time is about 45 minutes. Can be installed by yourself with a difficulty level of beginner. Tools needed for this job are a 3 8 ratchet, an 18 mm socket, a 3 8 torque wrench, a hydraulic jack, and don't forget your safety glasses. So, gather the tools, and let's install. Let's start, by jacking up the rear of your X3, to where the tires are slightly touching the ground. If needed, to raise the rear of the vehicle high enough, use a jack extension at the jacking point, to get the job done safely. Next, loosen the 6 radius rod plate nuts, using an 18mm socket. Then, set them aside as we will be remounting them shortly. At this point, attempt to remove the radius rod plate. You may have to raise or lower the rear of the vehicle to loosen the tension on the bolts. Once you find the sweet spot, the plate will remove easily. Now, remove the radius rod plate and set aside. First step, make sure there is no load pressing on the rods against the bolts. The rod should slide and move freely with some play. Next, remove the two lower rods, and let them hang free for the moment. Then, remove the two upper rods. Now, you can remove the small plate behind them, and set it aside. Now, stack the two upper rods on top of the upper bolts, so they don't slide off. Leave the two middle rods in place. These next steps can be tricky so be patient, and it will all go together easily. Next, pick up the dual shear plate, and slide the two rods into place within the plate. This can be difficult, as they need to stay between the front and back of the plate, as you slide them on the lower rod bolts. Work the whole plate around, until you can slide the plate and the rods, part way on. Next, while the bottom part of the plate is being held in place, do the same with the top rods, until they are part way on the upper bolts, Now, the two lower and middle bolts should be lined up, and sticking out of the plate enough to reinstall the nuts. Some shifting around may have to be done next, to get the two top bolts to fully line up with the plate. Once the bolts are aligned, slide the plate on enough to finish reinstalling the two top nuts, finger tight. Now, you can breathe easy, the hard part is all done. Next, tighten down the factory hardware using the 18mm socket. One last thing. Don't forget to torque the rod nuts to 90 foot-pounds. Congrats, that completes your DRT, X3 dual shear radius plate install. Now, with your new dual shear plate, also comes huge strength gains and rigidity for your suspension. Being dual shear also means preventing brakes, in common failure points. The result, is being able to use your X3 like it was intended out in the dirt, and over the rocks. Until we meet on your next DRT install, be safe out there. If you have any questions during your installation, don't hesitate to contact us via phone or email. We are here to help.